From childhood, we have been told that the universe is endless. It was said that there are millions of worlds out there, and that none of them can be reached. They said that they were thousands of light years away from us. But what if this is not the whole truth? What if we live in a multiverse where a thin membrane separates worlds from each other? And this membrane is not as strong as it seems. Seven worlds, seven variations of Earth were instantly merged. Those few who survived called this cataclysm the shift. Hold F to be born. What is happening here? Hold F. Interesting. Whoa. I looked cooler before I was born, to be honest, but still looking pretty neat. All right, move around, WSD. The space is dark and silent. It does sound kind of like there's like this weird void noise faint in the background. Voice resonates in your head. Um, I made you, I created you, who am I? Uh, space, I guess this made us. Uh, nothingness, just like me, okay. They call us the void. We are one, you have purpose. You can leave this place, meet with them, the envoys in the center of creation. Um, how did you create me? Made you from parts, anything that reaches me from their worlds, okay. Follow the thread, collect the seals, and bring them back here. Many realms, want our essence, because we have so much, okay, interesting. Um, seal, collect, okay, so need to collect some seals. Uh, sure, let's leave. Interesting. Alright, so we're collecting seals, tabula rasa, I guess he gave us some stuff, press two? No, he just gave us two of those, okay. Well, let's wander around here. Ooh, just moving. Who are you? Oh, we can attack. Interesting. I feel like the attack is way loud compared to the background noise. Might as well adjust that later. Picked up something. Uh, communicator, press control to open the communicator. Okay, control for communicator. Alright. Neat. Whatever. Uh, uh, hello. Dash, uh, space to dash. Okay. Space to dash. Are you bad? Kill enemy. Oh. Ow. Rude. Rude dude with attitude. You're like, is, you're surprisingly durable. It's like a Dark Souls kind of thing. Alright, uh, what's that skull? Ow. Alright. Dodges. Did I dodge and hit? So every time he does that, uh, so that skull means he's, that's the indicator that he's about to attack, is what that skull is. I like that, actually. Ah. Oh, that's, that's actually really nice. It's, instead of having to, like, oh, decreation, uh, dropped essence is increases to what? Uh, what? When target dies from decreation, the amount of dropped essence increases twice. I just, I just, oh, it's too complicated. I just want to play a game. Um, clear. Re oh, wait, is there? Can I, like, oh, there's, oh, there's like, there's like pages of stuff I can click here. I don't. I just, I. Too much, too much reading. Just play game. That's not how you do tutorials. A little bit of time. You know, the original, you know. Ooh, hello. The original Nintendo Mario Bros, you didn't have to read nothing. You just played the game and learned by playing. Whatever happened to that? I'm so tired of reading tutorials. This looks pretty cool, though. <laughs> void Dimension. The Void. Hmm. Alright, so uh, press the key to continue. All right, here we are. Obligation, collect this, Herald's seals. See, right there, simple, easy. Okay, uh, dialogue, whatever. I'll cr I'll try to go through it a little bit slow, so anybody who wants to read it can like pause the video and read it, but God, I just don't care today. I just don't have the patience today to, re to spend another, another day like playing 10 games and total of, like three hours a day just reading dialogue that just could have, been, could have been explained in a single sentence like this, right here. See this. This is all you need. Right here. Explore the hub. That simple. Easy. Uh, F to look. Locked door. Well, I can right click to do something. That's kind of cool. I do feel like the sound effects are too loud compared to like the other audio. Um, where's the... Oh, it's... 
like tabbing out weirdly. Sound effects too loud compared to everything else. Turn those down. All right, uh, back. Continue. There we go. All right, look here. Dimensional. Uh, just I don't care. I just I just why is it? I just don't care. Just play game. Just 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 want play game. CG just want play game. CG just want play game. I did say explore the hub, so I do have to like. Okay, so it's the eye where the little icon says I gotta go look at stuff. Okay, this is the hub. Ask Vidicus what happened to Archibon. Okay, so we gotta find. Okay, uh, so I guess this thing moving around here, the map is me. We're going towards these little icons here. Talk to you. Um, blah blah blah. Uh, I'll go through it kind of slow, so if somebody wants to pause it at each point, they can read it. But I don't care. I just want to play the game. I'm sure the story's interesting. I'm sure it's good. But personally, tired of spending three hours a day reading a uh, text and dialogue that most people don't give a crap about. But I will go through it kind of slow so that people who do care can pause it and read it. Try to appeal to everybody. People who don't care, well, we're clicking through it. People who do care, I'm clicking through it slow enough you can pause and read. There we go. Keeping everybody happy and helping my own mental sanity. All right, so uh, the keeper's talking to us. Okay. Uh, training. Okay, training, whatever. Begin training into the training area. Tab. Press tab into the training area. Oh, tab shows you where the quest is. Follow, follow this little icon here. That's showing me where to go. Okay, that's what we'd like to see. To the training room. Let me in. Oh, we gotta like, walk through the door. Press F to teleport. Okay. There we go. Tutorial area hub. Some blah, blah, blah about equipment. Don't care. My personal stance on games is I shouldn't have to read a book to p first to play your game. I should play your game, and playing the game itself should teach me it. Blah, blah, blah. That's my personal personal stance. Uh, you know, my my golden standard is like, uh, I saw a video about the maker of the maker of Nintendo's, uh, not Nintendo, but uh, of the original Super Mario, the original Mario, and he said, and like, the, he, like he de deliberately planned and made the game so that you could learn to play without having to read anything. Just like, oh, you, you can't go past her, so you have to press the button to learn to jump, et cetera, et cetera. Um, epic, uh, press left click to perform normal attack. One, two, three. On what, this? No, this, okay, clearly this. Training dummy, space to dash. One, two, three. Pick up Nox. How? Um, how do we do that? Who's next? Up here? Uh, F to pick up. Using consumables, uh, press R and then left click. Okay. Alright. Oop, something's happened. We got hurt, so R, left click to use Nox. I guess Nox is my healing item. Okay. F to pick up the mechanical claws. Uh, press left click three times for a quick succession combo. Hold left click to charge. Uh, blah, 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 don't care. Alright, one, two, three. Okay, hold left click to charge. And big AOE attack. Energy, we have limited energy, I guess. Limited energy, I suppose. Okay. Um, hold left click to pop, do an empowered attack three times. It's two. And three. There we go. Equipment can break. All right, press left click, space, or right click to swap out the items. Okay. All right, tutorials, a little, uh, ugh. Pick up sour fan good. Release shift to continue. Oh, my item broke, so I need to, like, shift. Oh, I ha I don't know. I'm confused. Claws broke. Right, I have to pick this up. Uh, use a power up item, press R, and then left click to break the power up. Oh, Jesus. All right, R, left click. Okay, this is weird. Um, R, then left click to use a fan good. R, left click. Pick up this guy. This is weird, man. Um, this control, just all this is just weird. Pick up mechanical claws. Okay. Pick up Nox. Gotcha. Pick up sour fan good. Gotcha. Kill an enemy. All right, you can actually get like damage me. Oh, oh maybe. Wait, it's like, take it slow. Armored enemies, more reading. Not, um, I'll scroll through it slow so, you know, you can pause and read if you want to, but... I just want to play games today. Oh. Dark Souls. Okay, he's like mad. Alright, so we're gonna get a little hit in there and dodge away. So it's Dark Souls. Hit and run, hit and run. Ouch. Throwing knives. Knives do stuff. Okay. Alright. Uh, enemy attack buff. Enemies can get attack buffs. Okay. Alright. So there's buffs and stuff. Could you... Stop. Alright. I guess there's a limited amount of time you can hold that attack. 
Maybe we, uh... There we go, hit him with the big one. I like the short, quick hits better, to be honest. With that. Stay away. So that's his, that shows he's attacking. There we go. And I don't know if that means just like a, like a bigger, nastier attack. And here we go. He's sad. Why is he... Does sadness mean he's like... Is there like a, like a morale thing? Would you just stop running? Talk about annoying. Nope, don't know that. My, do I like a range? I'm gonna do like R, do the Nox thing. That's the like heal. What is, what's the other? What's the f this one do? Not, I don't want the heal. I want the. I just keep dropping this one again. Where's the, the fan go? I got I press. I, I got press E. Oh, I I have knives. All right, threw it. Okay, E throw a knife. Oh, right click to like sh right click to shield. What's this do? Oh, you can shield, but it's like a very temporary shield. Here, shoot me, shoot me. And. Oh, I reflected it. I, I did take a little bit of damage. But oh, okay, okay, so that's kind of neat. So if you look down here, oh, am I like taking damage over time? Do you mind? I've had enough of you. Did you get your health back? Did you heal? Just die. I'm bored of this. What are these stars above its head? Probably told me right. Would you stop running? That's such an annoying, boring mechanic. All right, would you die? All right, we have like a stamina meter for our attacks. All right, finally killed it. Well, that was kind of tedious. All right, can't move. We're going to come to me. Talking. Uh. Whatever. All right. Guess we can leave now. Attack you. Gotcha. All right, so it's kind of what well, I would categorize that in one of the more not like insanely tedious tutorials, but like. Yeah. To fair, I didn't like do it properly because I didn't read it, but I'm just, I'm super over uh, games with developer has to, you have like, you gotta sit there, like, read, read this page, do this, read this page, do this, like, it's just, it's too much. It's too much, I'm tired of it. I am out of patience for, um, developers that make games where, like, the tutorial is just like a, ugh. Like, whatever happened to intuitive gameplay and simplistic tutorials? If I wanted to be in school, I'd be in school. I play games to, like, escape from the tedium of real life, not to experience more tedium. And tutor- like, text-heavy tutorials are tedious. It's 2021. Stainers are high. You know, you think the kids are reading long, in-depth tutorials when they play Fortnite? I don't think so. Are they? I don't know. <laughs> Couldn't tell you. Don't play Fortnite. Alright, see, this is more like it. Get in there, just smash, smash stuff. You know, you can, like, like, the skull thing is great. You see the skull above the head when they're about to attack, and then they attack. That's intuitive. That's intuitive. You're like, oh, okay. When they're... Oh, what just happened? Okay, I guess we hit the global map. Alright, well, I guess we go over here? Alright, sure. Uh, yeah, space. Enter. Uh, double click. Click again. Can we, what, what's happening? Oh, he's, oh, we're moving. We're walking across the golden map. Okay. Alright, it's kind of neat. Moving along. Guess we can't go through into wherever this alpha core. Do we want to go there? We need to go to the Q dimension. This is our little mission thing over here, so clearly that's where we got to go. That's the huntsman where the core is. Yeah, let's uh, go in there. Alright. See what we got here. It does seem like it's a pretty good game. I'm just... I just... I, I'm... I'm hypercritical of tutorials. I've experience some bad like that tutorial wasn't even that bad i just i don't know i'm i have my standards are extraordinarily high when it comes to tutorials because i've 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 ex i've been traumatized by bad tutorial after bad tutorial after bad tutorial uh i'm real um all right i'll listen to you and decide what to help you or not sure um what vibrations can you show me where it is got it continue your story Let's get to the point. Uh, what can you offer me in return? Um, that's not much. Don't the tribes pay you for training their hunters? All right, I'll see what I can do. And, uh, ellipsis. I'm glad I'm not actually reading everything, because I would spend literally 80% of this video reading if I was reading everything. My god. I'll do my best. Leave. I'm trying to go through slow enough that people can- that- the people that do want to read it. I'm trying to go through slow enough that they can actually pause it and read it, but... 
Yeah. Don't care. Just want to play a game. Just want to play a game. Huntsman. Uh, are you alive? Okay. Um, okay. Thank you. Except the bundle. I am summoning you. Is this guy going to join us? Engel, I summon you. Mercenaries. Oh, he's hired somebody. Okay, cool. So we get mercenaries. Welcome to the crew, buddy. This guy's gonna help me out. Nice. Alright. Can we, uh... Go play some more game. Level up. One to upgrade. We leveled up. I saw that on top left. Uh, eat upgrade. You guys, like, click it. Select slot unlocked. Uh, how about this one? This one? Can't click it. Here? Here? This one? This one? Oh, you have to double click it? 75, 75 more this to upgrade? Alright, I don't know what the heck's going on here. I'm out. Keep it moving. Keep it moving. What's this? What's this? That that thing there that popped up down there for a second. What's that? Oh, find the first group of hunters. Maybe I'm supposed to like leave here now that I've talked to these guys. I have to go out and find I have to go find some hunters. Okay. Sure. Let's go find some hunters. If I can get out of here. There we go. Global map. Um, uh, this... Scout the area of the coordinates? Sure. Why can't I... There we go. Click. Double click. Okay. Double click to move. And in we go. Loading again. A lot of loading screens in this. Alright, here we are. Scout the area of the coordinates. So, just move around. Got our guy following us. What's this? What's the point of him for? Or right, whatever, we'll run around. I didn't mean to leave, okay, I... Back in! Load again. This is not a game for somebody who's in it. I'm in a very impatient mood. This is not a game for impatient people, I can see that clearly. So... How do I tell, like, what's... Okay. I guess it's hard to tell what leaves the map and what doesn't. I guess go towards all the stuff on your screen, huh? Hello, freaky looking thing. Who are you? Um, what do you want from me? Uh, did you touch them? Uh, okay. Stop speaking in riddles. What do these mirrors do? So, oh my god. I'd be, I'd be, I might as well, like, grab it, like, <laughs> I'm glad I chose not to read the text for this game. Oh, look at this, his tongue out, gross. If I, I could have, I could have just, like, literally grabbed a book off the bookshelf and sat here and read the first two paragraphs. There's so much dialogue in this game, thank goodness. Can you get to the point already? <laughs> That's what I'm thinking, brother. Yeah, some people like this lore stuff, so they don't enjoy it. Uh, me, I play too many games a day to read all this stuff. Who created these mirrors? Is that all? Uh, what should I know about mirror dimensions? So much text. Goodbye. Alright, thanks for nothing. Oh, and he's gone. Alright, well. Later, skater. Thanks for nothing. Mirrors. All right, uh... Oh, so they're, they're checkpoints. Thanks! All- Thanks! All of that just to tell me that this is a checkpoint. Jesus Christ, man. All right. Well, that's kind of cool looking. I guess that means I activate the checkpoint. It's really cool looking! But, uh... Yeah. <laughs> All the dialogue was not necessary. Just say, have one message that pops and say, Hey, these are your checkpoints. Boom, job done. This game is not- This game is- This game is made for patient people. That's kind of cool. Person hiding in the ground under the ground there. I see you. Can I like attack you from distance? All right, whatever. This game is made for uh, patient people. You have to be uh, a patient person to play and enjoy this game. It's is what it seems like. Fair enough. All right. Uh, am I am I done here? Can I leave? All right, just leave. Whatever. I'm out of here. I'm out. Go somewhere else. All right. So that's the mirror. Uh, let's uh. Uh, do we, let's... These are probably trapped hunters, right? Let's go over here. Alright, uh, alright. Why is there... So there's a world karma on the top left. I'm not sure why it's so slow and boring to go from one way to the other. I think it's just a... It's weird, like... It's like a slow-paced... It's a... It's weird to have a Souls-like game feel slow-paced and boring. Um... Because that's what I'm getting from this game. It's a Souls-like game, which are usually, like, challenging and stressful and difficult. Um... Combined... With a lot of stuff that's like, you know, boring. 
All right, switch. So, I'm here. So look. Oh, hello. Hey, actual combat. Oh, excuse me. All right. Yeah, get a mercenary. Be useful. Nice. All right. Oh, dodge that. That seems bad. Ow! All right. Now we learn. See right there. We learn. Two of game. Fan goods. Oh my god. I just don't care. I just don't care. Let's search this guy. Pick this up. I just want to. Just want to roll around, and check things out. I want to. I want to play my game. I don't know. Am I the only one who likes to play their games instead of read their games? Is that is that just me? Am I out of line? Am I being too impatient? I'm being too impatient, aren't I? Sorry. I'm only human. Yeah, come here. I guess I, pl I guess I play so many indie games every day my standards get pretty high, you know? I guess maybe that's what it is. I've played s I play I play so many indie games every single day that like my standards get high as far as like you know, what's what's good and what isn't, what's acceptable, what isn't, you know, what's engaging and fun and what's not. Like, I, I'm sure this, like, I'm sure it'll be a fun game. Like, you can tell by, you can tell by, ooh, I like this, I like that spin. Just by the, you can tell just by how it looks visually that this is probably a good game that somebody's worked really hard on. Healing items. It's a good game that somebody's worked really hard on, and I'm sure it's a good game. It just requires, it. It's designed, like, games are designed for intended audiences. And clearly the intended audience for this game is some is people that enjoy a little bit of Souls-like action with a lot of reading and learning. Which is fine. Everybody likes what they like. I like how this mercenary guy distracts some of these guys off of me. There we go. So yeah, this it's it's an audience. It's 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 a game designed for ouch for patient people. Mercenary, you're supposed to handle this guy. Be, be do better. Dodges. I like how it says dodges. Nice. Did you hit him? I wish I had more knives to throw projectiles at, but well, souls likes are all about the melee, aren't you? I feel like my mercenary is really not doing very much. These things just keep coming, man. All right, would you die already? It's weird how like. Stop running away from me, that's so annoying. Jeez. Alright, let's uh, press R. Left click that. That should heal me, right? Yep, R and do it again. It's annoying how the enemies like run away from you, I don't like that. I guess that's a core thing in a lot of games, but... Normally melee characters don't run from you. I guess these guys aren't really melee, are they? They're shooting projectiles at me. It's still annoying though. There we go, get him out of here. If I break this... Ow, little baby one. Why does he run away all... Why's my dude, like, frowning all mad and running away? What's that all about? Alright, let's make sure they're... I thought they were gonna come out of there as well, swiping. A little bit of this. There you go. Mercenary's kinda lackluster, I'm not gonna lie. Hey, every little bit helps. Did this guy just... Did, did he just... He's burrowing and healing, you little brat. Hey, mercenary. There we go. I was gonna say, just do something. Alright, we're destroying stuff. There's, like, a chest around here somewhere. See on the mini-map? Aha! Uh -huh. Over here. Give. Pressed. I did. All right, just doing a thing. We get a uh, bronze coin. All right, I'll take it. Oh, let's go this way. What do we have? Yeah. So the combat, like it feels the combat, it feels okay. You know, it's fine. You click. You know, it's your it's your it's your souls. Like you do your left click to attack, and you can use space to dodge attacks. You know, gets the job done just fine. Nothing wrong with the combat. The, the amount of the reading in the, the amount of reading in the game was kind of excessive at the start. But to be fair, that's something a lot of games do. Like, even like big AAA games will like... There's some big AAA games that the first like hour of the game is literally no actual gameplay, just story building and whatever. So, clearly some people like that, right? Some people like all the story building. Press space to form a short quick dash. Thought I already had that. Is it like an upgraded dash, I guess? It, lo it looks different. Tumbleweed. Get out of there, little guy. Take him out. Alright. Eh. I'm not sure how I feel about the game yet. I'm not sure how I feel about the game yet. Oh, hello. Next area. Combat feels okay. Did we find the trapped hunter? I, I, I keep accidentally, like, leaving areas when I don't mean to. It's... It's... I guess, like, it's... Like, the line... It's... It's not... I, I don't feel like it's clear enough when I'm leaving an area, like, if- so I'm right here, 
So right, if you look at the mini map, you can kind of tell when you're leaving the area. But when you're when you're walking around the map itself, like right here, like I did that. I guess I guess the trick that tells you when you're about to leave the area is the fact that the the screen stops scrolling and you get really close to the edge. I guess that's your dead giveaway. But yeah, most games have like more of an indicator that you're about to leave the area than that, like a like a like a, a line or a border. But I mean, yeah, I guess. So that, like, that's your clues, like, okay, like, we're here, screen scrolling left to right, now we're here, screen stop scrolling, okay, that means that's the exit, so, that's how we know, okay, good to know. We'll take this, we're picking up stuff, I don't know. Wasn't there supposed to be a group of hunters here? I feel like I checked this whole area and there's nothing here, yeah, there wasn't. Are they just not here? Are they underground? I don't get it. I guess we'll leave here, yeah, it's when the screen stops stop scrolling, so we know, okay. Are they over here? Double click. Maybe, maybe, maybe they're over here. Find the second group. Did I find the first? I don't think I did. Let's enter and see if we can find them. Alright, here we go. How am I feeling about the game overall so far? <sighs> I don't know. Might just, I might just not be in the right mood for it. Or it might not just be the kind of game that I enjoy. But overall, I'm just kind of feeling kind of meh about it. Feels kind of meh. Like, it, it plays fine. It does its job fine. Just, I don't know. I think I'm just not in the- I think I'm just not in the kind of mood for this kind of game. Which is fine, it's just- it's not my job to enjoy the game I'm showing you guys. I don't- I don't dislike it. I don't dislike it, like, it's okay. You know, it feels alright running around slapping these guys a little bit, you know? It's alright. Here we go, here's some action. It's not bad. Oh, here we go. Now things are getting interesting. There's a lot of them. Alright, so it's not really about the one on one- oh my god, it- oh my god, two men- alright. Is this a bullet heck or a souls like? Which is it? Jeez. Did you die? Oh no. Nope. All right, we got. Oh, we got E. Ah, aha! Here we go. Uh, I got. I got. I got. I got range weaponry too. Get. Yep. Oh, jeez. So it's. I feel like this game is like a. It's like it's. It's like a. It's like a souls like uh, bullet heck is what it is. Get out of here, you little turds. It's like a. Yeah. Give me this. The Souls Light Bullet Heck is what we're looking at. Seems to be the most accurate description I've uh, had so far. Is this like for you? Weird little thing. Come here, who's in here? Get destroyed. Oh, you want to fight? Nasty little worm creatures. Get a mercenary, do something useful. Alright, let's, uh, I can press uh, R and click that to heal. That was a nice heal. Give me that. Okay, that works. Hello, friends. Where are these hunters of which we speak? Come here, you little... Yeah, good job, Mercenary. You couldn't even, couldn't even one-shot the little guy. Come on, Mercenary. Step it up. I guess the whole point is for us to do a thing. I don't like this. It's annoying. Get out of there. I guess you can knock him out of it, kind of, maybe? Maybe he just came out of his own. I don't know. Get wrecked. Alright, my weapon broke. What am I doing? Picking a new weapon to put in the spot? Uh, I don't really have one. Shift. Or, I don't know what's going on. I feel like I've been using my hand the whole time. I guess we're still using our hand? I don't know. Whatever. Maybe you have to claws before, now we're just using our bare hands. It does seem like we're doing less damage. Maybe? Maybe not. Stamina, please. Primitive heart. Picked him up. Okay. I don't know where these hunters are at. I don't know. Well, I guess we can go over here and see what's in the, in the chest, at least. Oh, more of these guys. I'm bored of fighting the scorpions. It's, it's a lot of the same enemy. Yeah, that's fine, though. A lot of games tend to recycle enemies at the start, and more unlock as the game progresses. I haven't exactly been through a lot of areas, huh? That is the desert, so it makes sense. Come here, you. Come here. Come here, die. Alright, I got you dead. Explosives. I oh, can use explosives and stuff, so there's items you can attack with all. Alright, well, I get an idea what the game is about. Somebody out there is going to enjoy it. Not my cup of tea, but... It seems it seems fine. I'm sure some people enjoy it. In fact, some people, some people might love it and have a great time with it. Me, I'll probably never play it again. Not my cup of tea. Um, I just, I just don't like these kind of games. I guess I don't know. But yeah, it seems fine. The control the controls seem fine. Seemed a little little bit dialogue heavy. These it went from being dialogue heavy to like highly repetitive gameplay. So I see why all the dialogue is in there to like distract you from the fact that the gameplay is kind of like you're just fighting scorpions again and again and again. But um. Yeah, it's fine. Um, some of you'll like it. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked that, 
please subscribe and check out some of my other stuff.